Uh, at first, your goal is to just jump with no vest and no ball onto a box maybe 12 to 16 inches high. When you've mastered that, then you move up levels on the box. Uh, safety always has to be the number one thing you're concerned with and landing on the box safely. They'll jump onto the box, which reduces as much impact as possible, and then they'll walk down almost a resemblance of a staircase to get back to the start. So we don't have them jump back off just to, to help preserve their ankles and knees. Uh, and by putting something in your hands, such as a ball, you're taking your upper body out of the movement, which makes it more difficult. Obviously, by adding a weighted vest, now you're jumping with extra weight, makes it more difficult. And then they're also jumping on the highest level box that, that we use, which is 36 inches. So those three things, uh, and these are college and pro level players that you're seeing in this video, uh, perform these. So this, again, make sure that however old you are, whatever fitness level you're at, that you're doing so appropriately with, with your progression. On landing, you want to make sure that the weight's fairly evenly distributed with your foot. You're not landing on your tiptoes, but you're not landing with a loud thud heel to toe. Uh, we, we tell our players to land with what we call a quiet landing or a soft landing, uh, almost like you're landing on clouds or landing on pillows or like a ninja, uh, because if you land with a loud thump, all of that is sent like a shockwave up your body and it will affect your ankles, your knees, your low back. So a nice quiet landing, they'll land in the same position that they took off from, which is chest over knees over feet. Uh, and, and again, we want it uh, soft landing, weight evenly distributed on your foot, and use your body kind of as the shock absorber for the whole movement. So you should be able to perform a box jump with almost little to no sound. It's not a conditioner. This is something we're looking for max explosion on. And we tell them as well, you don't jump just high enough to get on the box. You jump as high as you can every rep, and if necessary, you come back down and land on the box. So every jump you do, regardless of the box height, should be very, very similar.